All right, guys, we're uh, sitting in the Rover. It's kind of a nice spring day here. It feels good to not uh, freeze. So I wanted to revisit the uh, the key making with uh, with this scan tool. Um, the folks um, over at uh, at the company uh, they did reply, and they gave me one or two pieces of feedback that I have tried already off camera that were not successful. But uh, as with many things that stump me with this car, I find the best strategy is when I'm getting you know turned around, uh, I call it quits, I step away for an hour, a day, a week, whatever I can, and I come back to it. So I'm just looking at the directions with clean eyes and uh, I want to give this thing another shot. So in, in their feedback, they basically said, before you access the key programming function, the ignition should be on. Now, ignition on, is that defined as ignition switched on or is that car on? I don't know the answer to that. Um, so that's kind of where you know this thing is up for interpretation. So I'm going to start the car got the program key here and then I've got the uh, unprogrammed key right next to it um, this is the unprogrammed one can't really tell the difference between the two can't really tell the difference between the two anyway well, you just have to trust me that I'm not scamming you can kind of see that right okay so I'm gonna start the car let's turn that down and we're gonna go into we're gonna go to OBD2 Paired. Five DTCs. That's nothing. Let's go to diag uh, exit the current diagnosis. How do I do that? Exit. Yes. Okay, I think I went to the wrong one. Diagnostics. I'm going to go Land Rover and I'm going to go OK. And I'm putting my finger over here because I think it's going to detect the VIN. And I don't really care if you have my VIN, but. I probably shouldn't broadcast it, right? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna do automatically search, okay. Vin Bing Red. Okay, yes. Vehicle configuration data is being loaded. Okay, so, all right, so I think here we are, and she said ignition on, cars running, so I guess that means ignition is on. Sounds simple, right? So we're gonna go to special function, we're gonna go to alarm security, we're gonna go to key programming. It's gonna read you a very frightening declaration we're gonna go okay the following screws are struck you various ignition prompts it is important that these are followed exactly blah 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 how many keys are you programming I think I'm programming two I've got the existing one plus um, the the new one okay insert the first kit key to be programmed into the ignition barrel it's already in there okay so Set ignition switch to off. Okay. Please ensure the ignition remains in the off position until instructed otherwise. Okay. Communicating. Set the ignition switch to on within five seconds. Okay.
perform the following steps now. Remove the key to the ignition barrel, insert the next key to be programmed to the ignition barrel. Uh, it, programmed into the ignition barrel, please ensure the ignition remains in the off position until unstructured otherwise. Please press OK after the above steps have been completed. Okay, key out, new key in. New key in, okay. To on within five seconds. Okay, we're, 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 oh my goodness. Look at that. Set ignition switch to off. Okay. Check that both keys are functioning correctly. Okay, this is the other key. This is not doing anything. That one's working. That one looks like it's working too. Let's go. Started it. Key here. Okay. I want you to see this. Here. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go here. Look at that! We got a winner! We got a winner, ladies and gentlemen! Okay, this thing worked. Okay, so now, good. You know, this is kind of proves my point is like, you know, like I read that direction. I'm uh, working with one hand here. This, this uh, button down here doesn't work, but the unlock. Okay, both work. I'm excited. Great, awesome. Listen, thanks to I'm gonna put, uh, I think the lady's name is Vivian, and um, I'll do some more reviews on this thing, but I just wanted to post an update that this thing actually did work, and it's not their fault, it was user error, and that's all I've got for today's episode. No editing, no cutting. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, everyone.